So I'm Ian Nolson. I'm the Managing Director of Selling Success, which is my own business. We're into transforming people and businesses by helping them grow and develop. When I work with clients, particularly the business directors, to talk about their businesses, where they want to take their business, what they want to do, what's the outcome. Do they want to sell their business? Do they want to um, grow it, but the role that they have within the business change from working in the business to working on the business? Or do they want to um, employ somebody ultimately to run it and they just take a, an ambassadorial or a chairmanship role? And whatever those outcomes are, we're looking projecting three to five years hence. Now if somebody wants to sell their business, it's actually very important that you consider what the state of the market would be in five years. If there's no future in five years, or there's a limited future for a business, then actually one of the advices you might be giving your client is you need to diversify into other sectors. You need to move from industrial into professional services. So my interest in the future and predicting the future of work and what are going to be the hot sectors started about five years ago and I've written a, an annual blog on the subject and I've written many blogs on it throughout those years. As technology has come on the horizon like automation, uh, machine learning, uh, augmentation, 3D printing, and the revolutions that are going on in healthcare. Um, you can't ignore those things. You can't ignore the global skill shortage we have. But I'm repeatedly asked to come back and talk about the future of work and how I see it changing. What is Global Recruitment Thought Leaders about? We're reaching out to thought leaders across the UK and Europe and the rest of the world. And we want to engage and have a chat and discuss with them and interview them to find out their thoughts about the future of work, the future of recruitment, and how they see it in their part of the industry, in their part of the globe, how they see it impacting and growing and developing. And the world of work is transforming, both in terms of technology, in terms of leadership and leadership styles, how you engage and get workforces to work for you and motivate them and retain them, that is all changing. And I think it's, it need, we need a healthy discussion and debate about what is the right way forward.